Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. I kind of just wanted to vlog and I want to show you guys my Christmas decorations. Um, yes, I decorated early, but I'm one of those people, I guess. Um, it is Thanksgiving week, um, like it's the weekend right before Thanksgiving. So I have decorated like last week, I would say, is when I started. Um, so I want to show you guys a few things just to start this video. So first of all, this is our tree. Um, we have very high ceilings, so we knew that we needed a big tree. It is 15 feet, and it was very hard to put together. Um, but we did it, and we also got these lights um, that you can control from your phone. I just got them on Amazon, and you can do different like scenarios. So let me show you. So if you just look at it like this, and then you click this right here, there's all these different options. So if I do candy cane one, it's so cool. And then you can do like all these different ones. So it's kind of cool. Um, we love it. And we also got our stockings. I got these on Etsy. Um, since we moved to a new home, we kind of wanted new decor. And I, so I thought might as well get the ones that have our names on them so we can keep them for a long, long time. Um, I'll link the Etsy, Etsy shop that I got him from. We're also waiting on Smokies. I got him like a dog paw one, so we love these. And then I'll show you guys the outside first of my porch. So this is my front porch decorations. I did, oh, that fell. I just realized that fell. Um, but I have these bows instead of wreaths because I just thought it was like really cute. I saw it on TikTok. Um, I have to fix that one a little bit, but... I have these bows on here. I just wrapped some ribbon all the way around the door and then just tied these on with the little like ties that it comes with. This one needs fixed a little bit. It was so windy last night. Um, and then I just have this garland all around. I have this cute little Christmas wagon. And then I have my little station for our delivery drivers. I got this on Etsy. So I just put it on the tree and then we have all the snacks for them and water and they've been taking stuff so it's really exciting i love to do this and then this needs cleaned off but this is our little thing here so i'm loving it so much out here and then on the inside so on the inside it also has bows there so yeah i love it so much and then up on our balcony we decided to do some garland and then i put bows on like each little thing so at nighttime it's so nice and we put the fireplace on and we're just in the Christmas spirit. So I've been having so much fun decorating um, just cause obviously we're in our new home. So it's been really fun. Also have some cute little knickknacks over here, which I need to change this. But we have this little countdown that Weston likes to change. And then we have this that I already had and like this really pretty Christmas tree. Hi, what are you doing? And then this is our table. I need to wipe it down, but we have these. I wanted to get all of these, but they didn't have enough. So we got the red little flower ones. And this is the little center piece. Jack's got his first haircut today. Yay! He looks so freaking handsome. Jack's like a mama. He's dancing to the show. Whoa. <laughs> You like this song. <laughs> He's so cute. Yay! He looks so handsome with his new haircut. So freaking cute. I was seriously so nervous to get him a haircut because you guys know, if you remember, if you've been following me for a while, Weston was horrible with his haircuts for so, so long. He would scream bloody murder. It was like, the worst thing ever. Like me and him would both be crying. I was sweating. Like it was just freaking horrible. So I was really nervous today. Um, going to give Jax his haircut, but he did so good. He just sat there and they put on a little show. We have a new kids um, like haircut place here. So they have like little cars for them to sit in and um, TVs with like cartoons on it. So he did so good. He didn't cry a single tear. He, ha he cried when they made him get out of the car. Like he was just like having so much fun. So whew, that was a sigh of relief for sure. So we'll definitely be going back there for their haircuts. Um, who knows, he might get scared of them at some point, but it was really good. So I feel good about that. Um, also we have some 
family members uh, that are going to be living with us for a few months. So I'm going to be getting together their bedroom and I just have all, I have all the bedding in the wash right now. And I'm going to kind of show you guys how I set up their room for them and the bathroom downstairs. They wanted to stay in the downstairs bedroom because, um, uh, he likes to play video games and it's just easier. He said, if they stay down there, they're also bringing their dog. Um, we have a sliding door for them to let their dog out down there and there's no carpet. So, um, they thought it'd just be better for them to stay down there. So I'm going to get that ready for them. The only thing is there's no shower down there yet and there's no sinks, working sinks yet. Our basement isn't all the way finished. It's almost there, but it's not all the way finished. So I'm going to kind of make the bathroom like a little bit nicer because we just don't use it down there. So I'm going to put up a curtain rod, even though the shower doesn't work, and a little shelf with some toiletries on it. And I'm going to put a full length mirror down there. Um, so they have like at least a mirror because there's just not a lot down there. We do have our couch all done down there and we have a TV down there. Um, our cabinets should be going in any day now. So hopefully as they're here, like things will get put together a little bit more, but we're just waiting on the countertops for the bathroom so we can put the sink in. It's just like a whole process. Um, but anyways, point is I'm going to kind of show you guys me getting ready for them to come. They are coming on Thanksgiving and then we're also having some friends here for Thanksgiving, um, from Ohio. So that's going to be really fun. And then of course the family members are going to be here. So I'm kind of getting, uh, prepared for Thanksgiving meal. Um, I'm actually not making a turkey. I'm actually, I decided to make um, crock pot chicken and gravy instead of like a whole turkey. One of the main reasons is because Weston has been learning about turkeys at school um, for Thanksgiving and he does not like the idea of us eating a turkey. Like he's like drawing turkeys and like talking about turkey, like silly turkeys. And then the fact that we have to eat a turkey, he's just like, he's not happy about it. So I decided to just do chicken and gravy. Everyone's fine with it too. And it tastes like basically like Thanksgiving. So, um, but I want to show you guys a couple of things that I got. So I got these cute little placemats and this is stuff we'll keep forever. You know, we, we just got this new house. So we're just kind of like starting to buy stuff for the holidays. I have a bunch of baskets full of all the Halloween stuff that I got. So I got these from, I think Amazon, oh no, wait, I want to say Amazon. Um, it might've been Hobby Lobby. I'm not hundred percent sure. I'll let you know in the description box. And then I got this baking dish, potatoes for mashed potatoes. I got, I got this cranberry sauce, but I'm going to try to make my own. I've never made cranberry sauce before, but one of my friends that's coming really likes it. We just never have made it. So I'm going to attempt to make it for the first time. Um, we got these chips because I'm going to make this chicken bacon ranch dip. We use these to dip it. And then also for the first time, I'm going to make homemade baked mac and cheese. I saw some really good recipes on TikTok, so I'm really excited to make like really good cheesy mac and cheese. And then I got this and some creamed corn to make this like creamed corn, like casserole that I saw on TikTok as well. It looked so, so good. So these are just a few of the ingredients. And then I got cream of mushroom and of course, crispy fried onions for green bean casserole. Um, I got some cream of chicken, mustard. I needed more I'm making deviled eggs. And then we got stuffing, which I don't normally make stuffing either, but my friend really likes it. So we're going to make that for them. Some kosher salt, chicken and gravy packets, some allspice for the cranberry sauce. I think that's what I got that for. Um, and then ranch packets and bacon for the dip that I'm making. I'm also making a chili dip, which I've made many times um, for like parties and stuff. It's literally just a can of chili. Um, all you do is spread a block of cream cheese on the bottom of a baking dish and then dump a can of chili on top and top it with some shredded cheese and bake it in the oven. And then you use these Fritos scoops to dip. It is like crack dip. It is so, so good. So I'm gonna be making lots of yummy stuff for Thanksgiving. I'm really excited to have people here. I'm really excited to have our family members here for a little while. So I'm gonna kind of show you guys me getting ready for that. Hi. You wanna say hi? Say hi. You want the camera? No, no. 
Also cleaned out the fridge, trying to get ready for obviously all the Thanksgiving food. And oh yeah, I got cheese and cracker trays and pumpkin pie. I also got a cheesecake um, from Cheesecake Factory. Um, so we're gonna have pumpkin pie and cheesecake. And then I got, I'm showing you guys like all the stuff I got. I got these cute little Thanksgiving napkins. We're gonna have the kids over at that table. The grown-ups are gonna be at this table, which I'm not done decorating this. I'm gonna have like a centerpiece, but this is like our nice dining room table. So we're gonna have the adults here. And honestly, we'll probably just do like buffet style since there's gonna be a bunch of the kids and everything. So we'll probably just put all the food on the island. Um, but yeah, those are some updates. Um, I ordered uh, some stuff from Amazon um, for the basement bedroom downstairs and all that stuff. So I'm gonna be showing you guys everything that I'm gonna be doing. I also have to clean the floors down there um, and then like remake the bed. So I'll show you that bedroom um, down there. I have the sheets here, which are done. So yeah, I'll probably continue vlogging after I put Jax to bed because I can't really do much while he's awake he's my shadow follows me everywhere so <laughs> all right guys after a busy day i'm so freaking excited we're doing hello fresh tonight this just looks incredible brown sugar bourbon apple pork chops <gasps> like oh even the green beans like i can't wait i love roasted vegetables so thank you to HelloFresh for sponsoring today's video. I'm so freaking excited to make this. One thing that's super nice, especially like the week of Thanksgiving when it's like super hectic and most of your groceries are like for Thanksgiving, um, not having to think of meals for the week is just so nice. So I actually have two of these that I get to make this week uh, before Thanksgiving so I don't have to think about dinners other than Thanksgiving dinner. And of course, like one of my favorite parts about it is that it's already completely ready for you. So you guys know HelloFresh is a meal delivery service where you get to go online and select the meals that you want for as many people in your household and there's different like categories you can choose from, um, like calorie friendly, family friendly, all different kinds. And each week there's like a whole new menu of things that you can choose from. So this is one of the ones that we got this week because it just oh, looks so good. It gives you the exact amount of ingredients already pre-portioned out in a bag ready to go. And it gives you instructions step-by-step step on how to do it. All of these meals are so easy and you guys know me. I love quick and easy meals. So I'm freaking pumped to make this and they're always delicious every single time. finished product and I am literally drooling at this right now. I'm so excited to eat this. I'm gonna take a bite and come back and let you guys know how it is. I'm sure it's gonna be amazing of course, but I'm gonna be right back. Okay, I'm seriously just speechless. It is <laughs> so good. I feel like every time I bake it, I'm like, oh, that's the best one. Like they're just all so flavorful and amazing. I can't wait for Shay to try it. I have his plate ready to go. Of course, I have a deal for you guys. So if you go to HelloFresh.com and use code FeliciaHealthFitness14 for up to 14 free meals and three free gifts. So special offer for the holidays, go to HelloFresh.com, use code FeliciaHealthFitness14 for up to 14 free meals and three free gifts. Like, that's just so amazing. Such a good deal for the holidays. Um, and again, you guys, I... I, I cannot recommend this enough. You know I don't talk about things unless I'm obsessed. And I have not one complaint about this meal. So here's what we got going on right now. It's a mess. I'm gonna make the bed here in a minute. Um, I just wanted to show you guys a couple things I got. So I just got some like goodies. They like sunflower seeds, um, just some stuff they like. I got some plugins for the bathroom down here. Um, I always do this. I have towels, Tylenol, water, sour strips. I'll put the snacks in here. And then we have the shower curtain that I need to put in the bathroom, curtain rod, uh, more sunflower seeds. Um, and then this is like a long cord to hook up for his Xbox. I got some fuzzy socks for her and I guess for him. Um, and then I got chargers for them down here. I always put chargers in all of our guest rooms, already plugged in, but I didn't have any down here. And then we have this, um, again, he's a gamer and he needs a bunch of hookup stuff. So, so I bought this for him. 
And then I got this is like a little shelf um, for the bathroom, like a rolly cart shelf. And I'm going to put all of the necessities in here. So I have a brush. Um, those are trash bags. I have feminine products, um, chapstick, cleaner, dry shampoo, body spray, makeup wipes, just like a bunch of stuff to put in there. Um, and we also have a mini fridge here. Um, they're going to be spending a lot of time down here. He games and stuff, so he'll be down here a lot. So I figured might as well put some waters and um, some of his favorite drinks in there and hers as well um, so that they don't have to come upstairs every second to get something. So. Um, I'm going to put that probably like in this corner because there's a plug right there. And then I also put this full length mirror down here because there's literally no mirror down here except for that one. Um, so I figured for her to like get ready and stuff because again the bathroom down here doesn't have much. So here's one of our bathrooms in the basement. Again it's completely unfinished so this whole thing is going to get ripped out. We're getting a new cabinet with countertop um, and then obviously we'll have the mirror. And then the shower isn't done down here yet, so we're still waiting on that to get done. So I'm just going to try to put a curtain rod just to like make it look nice so it's not just like ugly. And then I got some toilet cleaner, um, hand sanitizer because there's no sink. Um, and then I'll put the cart with all the necessities and stuff right here. So yeah, that's my plan for today. So first I'm going to make the bed. So here's the before and after bed is made the comforter's a little wrinkly but it's fine i think it has texture on it so it kind of blends in so now i'm going to attempt to put this cart together and do the bathroom so i'll show you guys when all this is organized and finished okay, so here's the bathroom it just looks so much better i feel like um i need to still get a toilet paper holder for down here which i is on its way and then i have all of this right here which Jax is trying to touch um, so I have extra toilet paper, um, hand sanitizer, uh, Glade spray, um, and then all the necessities here. So the one thing I'm a little annoyed about is this came with a stain on it, but whatever. It's just temporary for right now. So yeah, and then in here we have the bedroom all finished. So I need to clean this off still, but... I have just some snacks and stuff in there for them. And then all the extras are down there in this drawer. And have their chargers plugged in. And then in here is where he's gonna be having his gaming set up. So we have a mini fridge in there with some drinks in it. And then his desk is gonna go here with all this stuff. And then that's gonna run up to our router. So Jax likes to turn this off. This is where I'm at right now. So it's pretty much done. I just need to, again, clean off the um, dresser and just a couple last minute things. Alrighty, finishing touches. Got the sound machine over there. I vacuumed in here and then I have the toilet paper holder right there. Also, it smells so good in this basement. These little airwick things made the whole basement smell good. So, yes. All right, you guys. <sighs> I think that's going to be it for this vlog. I don't know how long it was, but oh, I feel like I got a lot done. I'm very happy, ready for our guests, and ready for Thanksgiving. So hopefully, fingers crossed, the meal goes good. Fingers crossed for all of you guys as well. I know it can be a stressful time, but we got this. So that's going to be it for this video. I will see you guys in my next one. Felt I'm done with the defense Throw back and climb over your fence Hide to show, show you the